Now, just like sugarcane producers, Louisiana sweet potato farmers rely heavily on outside labor to produce their crop. According to the LSU Ag Center, labor costs account for more than 40% of the crop's total input costs. This week in Louisiana Agriculture's Kristen Oaks now takes us to the LSU Ag Center Sweet Potato Research Station in Chase, Louisiana, where workers are hitting the dirt to harvest this year's crop. Behind this cloud of dust, busy hands reap the rewards of this season's sweet potato crop. Here at the LSU Ag Center's Sweet Potato Research Station, student workers dig in to learn just how much work goes into this crop. A pair of hands comes into contact with every sweet potato that's planted and many of the sweet potatoes that are harvested in the state. And so obviously that takes a lot of labor to get the job done. And Tara Smith knows sweet potatoes. The former LSU Ag Center sweet potato specialist says labor tops the list of challenges growers face. Unfortunately, we've had a lot of weather disaster type years in 2008 and 2009 and that has led to uh, several crop losses in excess of 50 to 60 percent for some of our producers. In addition to the weather related issues, we've dealing with a, an aging producer population and several retirements the last few years. And so when you couple those two things together, we've seen a decline in our acreage overall. Increasing crop acreage is just one goal of the Ag Center's new sweet potato specialist, Mavis Finger. She says while the acreage may be down, this year's crop is right on target. Early on, we had some uh, cooler than normal springtime temperatures and a lot of rain and that delayed planting in most cases. Um, but our growers were able to get in there from um, late May through July. and. Uh, since then we've had some good weather. It has dried up a bit and um, our growers need moisture for final sizing. Louisiana producers just hope this hard work will hit pay dirt. In Chase, I'm Kristen Oaks for This Week in Louisiana Agriculture. Louisiana is the fourth largest producer of sweet potatoes, harvesting more than 1.9 million pounds last year. The crop had a farm value of more than $45 million.